Hello boys and girls, welcome to Define Agile YouTube channel where we talk everything Agile, everything Jira and I share my experience, my 10 year experience with Agile and Jira with you and currently we are doing this small tutorial that will give you exactly what you need so you can search for different things in Jira and I'll do it or you ask me in the comments what you need and I'll record a video about it. So somebody asked me how to delete an epic. And when I say delete an epic, it's not an issue type an epic. I created some epic and I want to delete it. You might think it's easy, but it's not really that easy in Jira. So let me show you. Here we have a list of different projects I have. Let's go to, let's say, define agile, Kanban, test, board, and let's create an epic there. So if I say create, if I say epic to be deleted epic. Okay. It's created some epic. Need a summary. Okay. You see epic does not appear here. So we can't just go and delete it. Let's assign something to this epic as well. So to make sure that I show you what happens when you delete an epic. So then we put this epic here to be deleted. Very often we don't see epics anywhere. We go to backlog and it might not be epics even there. It's sometimes it's here, but you can configure your backlog so there's no epics in a backlog. So let's assume you don't see an epic. If you see epic in a backlog, well, it's easy. You just delete it. But let's say you have filter not to show epics, which is very, very possible. To do that, then you'll need to search for your epic. And you can go to a search menu. Uh, you can go to advanced issue search. Let's say you just want to find all the epics and figure out which ones to delete. Um, let's go and uh, here we can switch to basic. I think it will be easier like this. And then here we have a bunch of things. What projects? what types, and when I say type, I can select type epic, I can select search. Okay, so here we see all the epics that we have. You can select any epic, and now let's go to something very interesting. This is a question all of you guys asking me, so I'm gonna address that as well. I think the author of that question might have the same issue. Uh, which I also found a little bit confusing, but anyway, so usually you go here, you click on three dots, and you click delete. But wait, there is not a delete button. I keep on telling you guys, if you don't see anything, you most probably don't have permissions. So what you need to go is you need to do is you go to project settings, and you need to add yourself as an administrator, and then you will be able to delete. Uh, some people say. And I told you, but I'm a super admin. How could I, I don't have access to delete? Well, you can be super admin of the Jira, but you need to be an admin of this project. So you would go to people. You'd click add people. Put my name, your name, administrator, add. Once you're here, I go to three dots, you see the delete button. So let's delete and then let's see what happens with the story two. So I delete an epic, delete. Story two is still here. Show more fields. Doesn't have an epic link, so no epics. You just disassociate, disassociated Epic with everything that was connected to. But yeah, this is how you can delete Epics. This is uh, the trick with uh, having yourself as an administrator is very, very important. So if you guys don't see something, you need to be an administrator of the project. Hope it helps. If you're still confused, need my help or help with my team, go to a show notes and schedule a consultation with me and we can sit down for an hour, one-on-one, -on -one, or maybe more if you need, and I'll answer a question, help you out. If you uh, need to learn Jira step-by-step -step, and you're the kind of person who likes hand-holding, also there's a course uh, that I created that has a huge discount, click on that on show notes. You'll see it as well. And uh, I really, really appreciate you. Thank you for watching and talk to you next one. Bye-bye.